My first guest has been nominated for a Golden Globe, SAG Award, and an Oscar for her work in the film Promising Young Woman, which is in theaters and on digital and DVD. And now she's also hosting Saturday Night Live this weekend with musical guest Kid Cudi. Please welcome Carrie Mulligan! <laughs> Promising, looking promising, looking promising, y'all. Coming on again, coming on again, coming on again, y'all. Uh, I'm so happy to see you. Thank you for being on the show. Thank, Thank you for being. Me. It's so nice to be here. Thank you for being here in studio too. I know. With an audience. It's my first one. It feels great, right? It's so nice. It just feels great. The energy from that. I. I, I... Uh, are you excited about Saturday Night Live? Are you nervous? Oh, what are you goodness. feeling? I'm so excited. I'm very nervous. You, no, don't be. But it's going so quickly in it, a way that I think is good. It's sort of like you don't have time to think. You just go from thing to thing to thing. We, Suddenly you're there. Did you, you've done the writers' meeting where they all pitch you ideas and yeah. yeah. And I hadn't been around people for like a year and a half. <laughs> yeah. So I was just like everything, every single pitch was hilarious. <laughs> Like, like uh, I was like, I'm the best audience ever. <laughs> um, uh, just, uh, you know, just human proximity is so uh, exciting. I want to talk about uh, a promising young woman. Uh, came out earlier this year. Sure, you can clap if you feel like it. Sure. I, uh, racking up the awards ever since. Uh, congratulations, best actress uh, nomination for the Academy Award. That's <laughs> is your second. One. Yeah. What do you, do you? What do you remember about your first one? Do you remember? I was talking about this the other day to my friend who was there, and I, my memory is so hazy. I don't remember, I think I was just sort of so overwhelmed by the whole thing. I just remember being uh, in a room with Sandra Bullock a lot and being like, this is the greatest moment of my life. <laughs> I just... She's pretty cool. Oh, man, she's so cool and she's so gorgeous and speed I've seen like 700 times. And... Speed, really? Oh my goodness, Speed's the perfect film. Speed is the perfect film in any situation. <laughs> Like, really, if someone goes, well, let's watch a movie, what do we watch? You, oh, you go, could be in any mood, and you'd be like, speed. <laughs> it is never great. never time not to watch speed. Uh, I watched this, and uh, I, I, I was watching it, and I go, oh, no, 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 this is terrible. And I just felt, I, I mean, the movie's not terrible. Okay. The situation was terrible. <laughs> yes. Sorry, the movie's fantastic. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that's why I don't review movies. Yeah. Uh, no, I was saying the situation, I go, I felt bad for you, uh, your character, and I go, oh, no, 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 I don't know, I don't like where this is going to go. And then, wow, wait, yeah. whoa, if you haven't seen it, <laughs> wow, and I was like, that right there, the, um, the, anything I can do, whatever I can do to tell you that you are phenomenal. Oh, that's uh, that was so such cool. a good, <laughs> and the whole thing played out great. It is a, uh, it touches on a, a rough subject, but uh, in a weird way, there's comedy in there as well. Bo Burnham was hilariously funny, I thought. He's so brilliant, Bo, yeah. yeah. And, and we've got, I mean, that's, that's the thing about the film, is it, it is tackling a difficult subject, but it's, there's definitely, I mean, the majority of the cast were all comedians. There's Jennifer Coolidge. Jennifer Coolidge, Jennifer by the way, is, genius. she's unbelievable. Yeah. I mean, she plays your mom. Yeah. Uh, would she improvise at all? Oh, my goodness. Jennifer was, so she was kind of, we were on 23-day shoot, so it was very quick. So there wasn't much time to sort of mess around. But there was a, a dinner table scene in the movie where Bo, who's my boyfriend, comes and meets my parents. And Emerald Fennell, our director, came in at the beginning and said, just sort of like, you know, just like have like small talk, like, you know, ask her what she does for a living, blah, blah, blah. So we're sitting there and Bo's like, so, uh, oh, this is delicious. Um, wh what do you do for a living? And Jennifer's first answer was, uh, well, I've discovered late in life that I've uh, got a real talent for fish tank interior design. <laughs> <laughs> what? Which kind of just, like, wow. ruined everyone. And so then <sighs> we, and I can't, I'm, you know, I'm the worst person in the world for this. And so I just lost it. And then we started again, and we got to the same point. So what, what do you do for a living? Uh, well, I, I, I train small animals to detect carbon monoxide. <laughs> You know, and it just went on and on like this, and it just... How do you it, think of that? It got to the point where I was... There was no... So actually, in the film, there's a tiny bit where you can see that I've just completely lost it, and Emerald, I think, probably ran out of time. She <laughs> was like, like, that'll do. You're like, just take me off set. Yeah, yeah, just, get, just, just get me. I don't want to be rude, but get me out of yeah, the set. Yeah. I've been in, yeah, I've yeah. been in that situation many times. Um, but I love the attention to detail and little details. And one thing I noticed, I loved your nails. And I, Thank you. Uh, it's the, they're multicolored. See these nails? And uh, 
I just I kept looking at them. I go, oh my gosh, uh, it was just part of your character and part of the movie for me now. And then we were talking backstage. I was like, uh, you know, are you going to go to the Oscars with your mom? Mm. And and no, not this year. Well, no, mom came with me last time, and and actually she's amazing. She always comes with me when I'm traveling, especially with my children. Um, but because of the situation at the moment, she couldn't get in. Um, but she, <laughs> um, she grabbed me right before I left for the airport. She was like. I just, I have a thing for you, for the Oscars. She always gives me these, like, sentimental presents, you know, to open, like, on important days. Yeah. She was like, but you should just have it now. Um, but it's a bit weird, but, you know, just have it now. And I was like, OK, Mum. And she gave me this box. And within the box was a box. <laughs> Wait a second. And trolls or no, spaghetti? No, no, so she gives this box and, and I, open, well, I mean, I do you want to? You brought it here. Yeah, I brought Which... it. I brought it all the way, it came all the way from, from England. Yeah. That's the nails. That's How? The nails. Where did your mom get them? How did so the last day of filming, I guess, I came home and I was like watching America's Ninja Warrior and I was on the sofa and I just sort of started ripping them off because they'd been really annoying. And um, I just, I don't know, left them on the side of the sofa or something. <laughs> kind of I mean, normally... And my someone... mom was like, ooh, I'm going to squirrel these away. Because normally if were... I see a box of nails in someone's <laughs> apartment, I'm like... Call 911. Oh, yeah. yeah, at least yeah. call 911 yeah. and hope for the yeah. best. Uh, but yeah. this is pretty kind of cool. Yeah. And then she found this like weird, creepy box and, you know. Yeah, with a nice light in it. I, yeah. I think it's fantastic. Yeah. I love it, by the way. Yeah, no, me too. Mom, that's very, very thoughtful. Yeah, well done, Mom. It's very, very cool. And I love that you brought the boat w with you. It's coming to the Oscars with me. Is, is that right? No, it's not really. I probably won't be able to fit it in my Yeah, bag. I think you should do it. I know. We all think we should do it. Uh -oh. Yeah, you have to. Uh, thank you again for coming to oh, our show. You. I appreciate it. Break a leg. Uh, I've already heard that you're a joy to work with, so everyone's excited. I want to show everyone a clip. Here's Carrie Mulligan in Promising Young Woman. Take a look at this. I think you should go. But a second ago, you were determined for me to stay. You were pretty insistent, actually. I was a nice guy. Are you? I thought we had a connection, I guess. A connection? OK. What do I do for a living? Sorry, maybe that one's too hard. How old am I? How long have I lived in the city? What are my hobbies? What's my name?